What it do, YouTube? It's your boy, sir. And we are back with another Madden It video. And today, we're going to be doing Rookie Premier Hunters episode number four. And before we begin, can we get a round of applause for the flashback intro? If you know what I mean, you know what I mean. What it do, YouTube? We have 51,000 training, right? We're going to look at the list of all the Rookie Premier Hunters. There's a couple other ones I marked off that we saw in previous pack openings that happened during the week because I'm getting to that point where I think they're going to be coming out of packs here very, very soon. Probably not going to be able to finish the list, unfortunately. But hey, I mean, it's a good time to have it. If you like the video, make sure you like the video. Comment down below as well. If you are excited for this boosted odds, there were some boosted odds that happened in Legend Packs and such. And don't forget to hit the sub button, man. Free free doesn't cost you a thing. Neither is our love. Goal is 10,000 subs by the end of the year, man. 67% of you guys that watch the videos aren't subbed. Hey, help your boy out. It's free for you. It doesn't cost you a thing. Here's my love, baby boy. And here's the updated list, man. As you can see, we have three, four, five, six, seven, eight out of 32 completed. Well, we pulled during the week. Uh, we pulled Jalen as well as we pulled Jordan Davis are the couple of new ones that we pulled. So this is very, very simple. How it's going to work is we're going to go in here, go and train variety packs. If we pull any rookie premieres, we're going to mark them off the list. The goal was to pull them all by the time the rookie premieres came out of training variety packs. But, but unfortunately, it looks like we're probably not going to be able to finish it just because they're going to be coming out um, in a couple of days and I'm going to be out of town. So it is what it is. We might as well enjoy, right? We got an LTD impact. I just want to take a quick look and see how much the LT is going for. Um, I'm assuming it's probably close to half a million at this point. About 591,000. So yeah, I'm creeping into the half million mark. That's cool with me. I will take it. These coins were a combination from a pack opening you may or may have not seen already. I don't know if you did. If you didn't, it's from the game day pack opening. If you did, that's where this most majority of these training came from. We're going to open up this training. I'm going to open up with a game day pack. Game day packs to me have been pretty decent over the course of the last couple weeks. So I always like to start off with that, if not a little bit of a get a gold. Uh, 80 overall there we're probably gonna get one elite we do get two elites we'll take that 81 marlon humphrey three elites oh my god 80 miles sanders we'll probably sell that pack and we'll probably get back i don't know about 15 000 coins so it is what it is i'll probably take that for training i should honestly did it man but let's jump into the jungle shall we we got to get rookie premieres and i don't want to start off with the jersey have the ltd impacts we also have an option to pull rookie premieres and platinum players we need platinum players obviously 84 shack griffin I need to make back, I want to say like, I don't know, like one and a half million coins, maybe a little bit less. I'm not too sure exactly how much I need to make back, but if we're going to get a rookie, come on, dude. No, he's a duplicate, bro. I have pulled that guy like four times already in this whole thing, but we'll take him for coins. I I'm going to hang on to everything just because your boy's going to be buying a lot of rookie premieres here within this next coming week. If I haven't bought a bunch already, so we're going to get an 83 Austin Cobert. But we finally get a rookie premiere and it's just trash, man. And I feel like it's so rare to pull him that I might pull maybe one more in that's it i enjoy pulling train variety packs when training is a lot cheaper when it's when it's pretty expensive man i just don't enjoy it because i typically don't ever make coins or break even i typically lose so when zeus was in packs the training was a lot cheaper so it was a lot better to do now it's back up to the almost the 30k mark and such so it's a lot more difficult to make a little bit profit man come on let's be great if we're gonna get big 83 Frank Clark will take that. Let me know in the comments below what's our highest pool gonna be. Ah, I think we're gonna get an 88. An 88, I don't know if we're gonna get an LTD, but an 88 seems pretty doable. So we're gonna get a blue strat card there. I'm just gonna back out because we know it's gonna be about 26,000. I think we're at the point now where blue strat cards are, don't have any more value. Uh, it's just the purple ones that, that really do as we're gonna get Justin Lawler. That's why I skip over the green, the blue animation. I really don't care about that. It's really just the purple ones that I'll sit for because you never know. Those can be pretty expensive. 81 Robert Woods. I don't know if you guys, any Titans fans out there, but you guys are probably happy. Robert Woods is starting to look like old Robbie Woods now with the last couple of weeks. Oh, you never know. Maybe. I mean, he might have got lucky over uh, Allen Robinson. Allen Robinson's not doing anything over there in, in uh, Los Angeles right now. Uh, Carmen Curl, bro. I hate that guy. Come on, bro. I don't want to take a big L on this. We probably made a couple hundred thousand back already, but I need some more. 82 Quandra digs. I mean, that's all it is today. Like for me on weekends, man, I don't like doing variety pack openings or a lot of pack openings on weekends, even though I do. It's really just to get content out for you guys and that's it. But for me, like packs on the weekends are typically the worst throughout the whole thing. So that's why I don't really mess with them on weekends as we're going to get back to back blue track cars. I mean, this is probably on pace to being one of my worst ones, honestly. Maybe not. I shouldn't say that. It's definitely not worse. There we go. 85 Jeffrey Simmons. It's definitely not my worst ones. I mean, I think the one I had the most where I took well over like half a mil loss is probably my worst one. Is we're gonna get Alexander. Oh, he's an 83 in this game. Halfway done, baby. We get a walk off. If I pull an LTD, we're gonna make a little bit of profit. We're gonna get Thomas Morstead. Cool, 82 overall. We probably made, I wanna say like a three, 400K back, maybe like 500K. I just need like a couple 88s. We're gonna get a green strat card. I'm waiting for more stuff to happen in these things. Let's go, purple. Ooh, in the zone. I think this one has a little bit more value. We go for about one just 
sold for 78,000. So we'll take that. Pulling purple ones is like pulling a uh, rookie premier pretty much, right? Price wise. And if worst comes to worst, I can quick sell it and get out uh, and get to like 55,000 or whatever the case is. Only one rookie premier so far, man. We're going to be in another platinum car, which can be 81 Logan Thomas. But uh, just rookie premier hunters are going to be, it's just so hard to do. And it makes me nervous for Redux hunters. Redux has actually come out in our in training variety pack. It's going to be very, very, very difficult to do them. And uh, I'm coming to realize maybe hunters is truly impossible. The only ones we really be in was Bo's Nose Hunters last year. We did Campus Hero Hunters. We did beat that last year. But anything this year, man, is just so hard because the odds are just so bad. So we're really just taking L's, honestly. I mean, we're just, that's all it is. We're just a walking L, right? Is we're going to get a fucking jersey. Give me 188 plus or like an 87 plus something. 83 CD Lamb, I guess we'll take him. Ah, oh, dude, this is just not looking good right now at all. I'm going to be down pretty heavily. Coins, bro. I just keep taking L's. Like I can't, I can't keep doing pack openings, bro. Like I, I managed to snipe my way up and get coins again. And then I lose it within like 24 hours, bro. It's just not fun. Uh, 80 DJ more. All right. That negativity has got to go because an LTD is right around the corner. Boost track card. We'll take it. And I've seen people pull some heat today in train variety packs. I've seen quite a bit. There we go. 86 Chandler Jones will take him 95,000 coins. I've seen some people pull some heat. They tag me on Twitter with the uh, LTD pulls back to back 88 so it feels like they've been boosted for people but for me it's just the same but if you're hitting big man you're striking gold you're getting back to back 88 lts man congratulations that's absolutely massive oh baby there it is 88 mark andrews will take that give me back to back 88 give me back to back 88 followed by an ltd or 88 and an ltd right here 88 no nate hobbs bro i've only done back-to-back 88s one time i think it was uh aaron donald and cooper cup both rams so that was incredible i almost passed out if I can get one more like 86 plus, maybe one more rookie. Man, this is brutal, dude. Rookie, this might be the last episode of Rookie Premier Hunters because I don't think I'm gonna have another one dropping before they get out of pack. So this might just be the finale. We failed it, unfortunately, as we're gonna get Chawan Benley. All right, we can do it two more times. I think we probably made at least like six, 700K. Again, I probably took an L at some point because I use it. Rookie Premier, come on. Dude, it's the same fucking rookies I always pull. Uh, Logan's a duplicate, man. It's always the same ones. Winfrey and Bross. All it is. Can't even get a decent walk off of a rookie premiere to end it, right? Uh, ending with the blue strat card, man. Let's look at, look at the fucking binder. All right, let's see where we ended with. Uh, hopefully, we can have at least like 600,000 coins. And Mark Andrews helped a lot. Now, this is just going to be a rough estimate. Obviously, I'm not going to uh, quick sell the purple one. I'm going to keep that. Uh, but we're ending with 1 million. Wow, we actually did a lot better than I thought. We're ending with a million coins. I will go ahead and take all of these, man. I'm surprised we ended with that. We also pulled a couple rookie premieres here. So we probably ended with like 1.1 to 1.2 million coins. But we didn't do as bad as I thought. So if I sell these, I'm probably going to keep the rookie premieres for right now right more than likely unless i want to sell them and uh and kind of buy them back cheaper if i can get them for cheaper uh we're gonna sell this one for about like fifty-five thousand coins i guess we might as well just try to sell them for it be like extra fifty-five thousand there so yeah we probably you know probably broke even out of this whole thing it really wasn't that bad of an opening at all man rip to rookie premiere hunters man off to redux hunters damn it silly guys tell your mom and tell your daddy catch you guys on the next video <laughs>